commemorate the assassination of Imam Hussein, the grandchild of Islam's prophet Muhammad, over 1,300 years ago, Montreal's Shia Muslim community marched through downtown. They wanted to share what they say is his message of peace and justice. Good afternoon. This is Mikey Boston reporting from CUTV headquarters, Concordia University. This afternoon, we crossed a procession organized by the Shiite community in Montreal. The procession was organized in commemoration of the passing of Imam Hussein, grandson of the Prophet Muhammad. We head down to Atwater Park to meet with our reporter, Steve Boudreaux. <laughs> I'm Steve Boudreaux from CUTV News. I'm currently at Atwater Square where the Shia community, Muslim community has gathered to commemorate the death of Imam Hussein. He died for freedom of expression. He died for human rights. He was a human rights activist and a leader in the world. When he died at that time, he said the message is going to be carried on for everybody, for all white and black, for all people, not only for Arabs, for all the nations around the world. We believe as Muslims, and this is why we march the streets of Montreal, that there's going to be a day where Jesus Christ and Muhammad al-Mahdi, the inheritance of Imam Hussein, they're going to come and they're going to be united to spread peace and justice all over the world. Prophet Muhammad, who is the prophet of Islam, uh, his progeny, his... Uh, family was massacred in Iraq uh, the place is called Karbala uh, about 250 people 72 people are from his own family and this uh, dispute was just because some oppressors wanted to rule the the uh, uh, the territory and Islam and for them in order to capture the power they had to massacre these people. And that is the tragedy of Karbala. Imam Hussein said one word, and I'm going to conclude in that word. He said that people are two kinds. Either you're brothers in humanity or you look alike in religion. So treat them the same way you feel they want, you want them to treat you. This is the message we carry on every year and every year as united, as opening our hearts and opening our hands to all fellow people in the, around the world to spread the message of peace and justice.